Cornerstone, welcome to this week's update. I hope you have all had a fantastic holiday, if you had an opportunity to take some time off or maybe even go away. But uh, we are back and running. I don't know if you've been around in our services or seen on social media or maybe got the email, but we, are, we have started and we're going through the book of Acts. And really for us, we've, we've labeled this book of Acts. Um, our, our tagline is the church that Jesus is building. And really our heart is that, is to demonstrate and be the church that Jesus teaches throughout his gospels. I want to encourage you, uh, we've, throughout our sites and online, have put a, a suggestion of reading through the book of Luke, as well as the book of Acts, uh, for the next 40 days, um, just to kickstart and get familiar with, uh, with the book of Acts as we start preaching through it. So if, you, if you're not too sure about it and you haven't heard about it, uh, Version is an app that you can download. And um, in, the, in the details of this video will be that uh, reading plan that you can get hold of. We're really excited for it. Um, please come on our meetings with an expectation to see uh, Holy Spirit move, uh, move in power, empower us, uh, really to be the body we need to be, to be able to share the gospel, to be able to demonstrate the gospel. Uh, we, we are really excited uh, for this series. We feel like it's going to be a pivotal one in the life of Cornerstone. Um, I'm sure if you, if you haven't heard, all our sites are back up and running, all the normal meetings are going. Uh, please contact your sites if you want to find out about life groups, about prayer meetings. A lot of stuff is starting to roll out in all the sites, and it's an incredible opportunity just to uh, participate in church life again. And uh, obviously with all the precautions in place and all the COVID restrictions, uh, we're trying to do as best as we can to make sure we can have full uh, church life experiences in all our sites. Thank you guys. Have a great week. Good morning, Cornerstone. Uh, us as a family, the Herberts, we have some very exciting news to share with you. We're finally going, going to America. America. Uh, we want to thank you first for all your prayers and uh, persevering and questions on, on what's happening. And uh, with great joy, we are able to testify that God has opened an incredible door for us. Uh, we've been waiting for an interview in South Africa. Uh, a couple of weeks back when all the laws got adjusted, it looked like we'd have to go for an interview in Mexico. But um, the door that God's opened is we don't have to wait for an interview anymore. Uh, we are able to fly into LAX, have our appointment uh, at the airport, and they will grant our visa at the airport. This is, um, we don't really know the ins and outs about it, but we know that it's a door that God's opened. Our lawyer is busy getting everything ready for us, and we are really excited for it. We know that this is, um, we always speak about God opening doors. This is a, a God opened door, and uh, we have faith to walk through it. So what does this mean? This means that uh, we are going in two weeks' time. Uh, I know it's been a bit of a rush, but the 16th of May will be our farewell. Uh, we're looking forward to it just to celebrate and be sent. And uh, part of the journey is we have to spend uh, about 15 days in Mexico just getting rid of our, our South African COVID. You know, the COVID strain that, uh, that we have here is not welcome in America right now. So we have to spend 15 days in Mexico and then once we finish that, we can get onto LAX. And then from there, onto Wichita. And then it's really just trusting God to see when it's going to be a great time to transition into New York. Uh, we are so excited. We are full of faith. It's been a, it's been a journey. It's been a long journey. But uh, we know that God is still in this. We know that God is still part of this. We know that God has called us. And we are so excited as a family to finally be heading off. Um, it's obviously going to be an emotional time. These lost... A couple of weeks are always, are always going to be hard, but uh, we are excited to see what God's got for us. Uh, if I can ask you for two things, um, often people, we would love as many of you to come with us as possible, uh, if you're able to, once everything opens and come be part of what God's doing. But for now, if I can ask for two areas, if, if you feel you want to partner with us, can you partner in the first area in prayer? Pray for us that um, there will be no hiccups, uh, no problems with flights, no problems when we get to LA, uh, no problems in, in processing everything, getting the visa. Um, like I said, we, we definitely feel that God's in this. We're excited and we're just trusting for a clear route. So please pray. And then if you feel, 
you want to uh, give into this, please feel free to do that. And you can just uh, pop some money into the church's account, Market Craig and Taryn. Um, there are a lot of cuts that are occurring with this, but uh, we know God's going to provide everything we need. And um, there's two opportunities for you to participate and be part of this. Please don't forget us. Please don't stop praying for us. And uh, we look to forward to giving another one of these once our church has started in New York. Love you guys.